enjoying the second part of our honeymoon? It's sweet. We're at the beach. We're at St. Joe. We got some of my family. Hi. Assorted family members. And pups. Evan, how are you liking it? How are you liking it, pups? I like it. I just don't want to admit it. Man, how are you liking it? I love it. Molly does not love it. She's she loves she's the sand. Interesting. Interesting. Still trying to feel out the ocean. It's all my big bed. Are you proud of your castle? Do you like the beach? <laughs> We're at the beach, we're at St. Joe, Florida, and we're finding our second geocache, part two of the honeymoon, the St. Joe Marina. And somewhere nearby there's a magnetic geocache. Well, we found the geocache, but there's no paper inside. Jether, how are you enjoying my honeymoon? I wonder if perhaps ask a different way. How are you enjoying this family beach trip? Wonderfully. Good. Let's, we have enough stuff. Let's get some groceries. <laughs> Today we're geocaching with a bigger team. There's uh, lots of oysters on the ground. This is a kayak launch. We're heading for Bay Kayak. It rained this morning and last night. Hard for short people. It's not fair. Okay. And it's like a little magnetic tube. Going for number two. Oh, this is the Florida I know and love. Look at that swamp. Look at those sounds. That is one empty log. This is in uh, 203 geocaches. I think we've made our first first to find. No, we never did. The places that geocaching takes you, you get to actually read all of this, and now we know what's down there. 
We're being swarmed by mosquitoes, but it's because we're in the swamp. So what did you get, Dad? Swamp honey. Swamp honey. Is it like local? Yeah, it's made in Weewahatch. <laughs> so we're looking for Happy Feet and Apple Lunch. And I'm thinking it's in these pink ones based on the movie. But Got bug spray and all my cuts, but it's fine. It looks like a rock. It was a good geocache. Looked just like a rock, so it was a little bit of harder. Took us a minute, we kind of looked at it a couple times. Up the creek, raw bar. Sounds good to me. I'm really hungry. How you? Cola. Smoke mullet. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> I don't want to eat somebody's mullet. They got alligator, they got clams, they have a lot of local stuff. Sure. Alright, alligator taco, calamari, some family. Our lids open and everything spilled out. Yeah, it's quite open. I'm not used to not having my backpack open. Yeah, there it is. I don't mind grabbing it as long as nothing's cool. Since a restaurant is what we're just saying. They've got a little card they put in the geocaches they find. That's really precious. cool. Congratulations. We're still in Apalachicola. Really cute. Looks a lot like New Orleans. We're looking for Wendy's cookie jar geocache. So it was an actual cookie jar. Right. The bag got a little bit damp, so we signed the log real carefully. We're going to double bag it. Well, that was a cool cache. It was uh, outside of this little business. I definitely advise go in and shop at this business if you happen to be here. Owner type lady seemed real sweet, super awesome. Jeff wanted a cookie, I didn't actually see any real cookies. Yeah, somewhere in those. Nice. We found it. It was inside this bomb. I bet they do, and I'm always down to support businesses that support our hobbies. So. I guess everything gets real wet here. How much it rains yeah. daily. This atmospheric building, it's, it literally is just like a tin shed, you know, fans blowing, it feels good in there. Really nice antique shop. This is really cute. Look at that swing and everything on the porch. I love this whole town. I mean, ammo can on the steps. Right here. That looks really cool. Really cool. These have been cool geocaches. Though. They have been real cute. I fully recommend Apalachicola if anybody's looking for a place to go. Look at these little fish toys. Look at these historic buildings, like the old church right there. Oh, there's a new library on 12th Street. This is a historic library. Look at the Spanish moss and the atmosphere here. That moss is full of biting birds. Yeah. I remember that Spanish moss. Oh, okay. Mechanical refrigeration. Oh, good for the air conditioner. Yeah. For the development of the cell. She found it. And the geocache is called the Iceman Puma. Mary Ann found it in the jungle. It's called the Iceman Comet. Jan Gori is buried right here. He is uh, the inventor of the ice machine and mechanical refrigeration. There's a museum to him over there. In the cool old town square right here. This is for St. Vincent National Wildlife Refuge. 
voice. I love the these porches. Can. Nice adventures. That's us. I know that his face implies otherwise, but he really doesn't mind wearing the harness.